Shot by Paloma Perez, but a great ball. Now going forward to Schumacher from right back, sending in a chip cross header on and in. What a header it was coming off a great cross by Julie Schumacher. And it looks like the goal is going to be Morgan Dankinich's goal. And if it is, it's the 10th of the season for her. And Navy was knocking on the door the last six or seven minutes. We just mentioned it. And the goal comes in here, we believe, by Dankinich. And she continues her strong success here. We already see Dinkanich over the ball here, ready to take this free kick as Bucknell sets up their wall. You have four midshipmen on the edge of the 18-yard box, two behind the ball. You have to imagine it's going to be Dinkanich to take this, though. From this distance, also unlikely that a, it would go on target, trying to send in a cross. Here it comes from Dankanich, and it's going to go in. What a shot indeed. Morgan Dankanich with two goals in about a two-minute span. And just when you think she might be too far out to go direct with that free kick, she sends a beauty into the right corner. No real chance for Jesse Ashworth. And Navy has stunned this crowd in the last couple of minutes. Two goals for Dankanich. Navy in front two to nothing. Last week we did a lot of positional changes between like the outside forwards and the center forward and the attacking center forward and I think that versatility kind of made us more dangerous to the opponent because they didn't really know what to expect and we created a lot of opportunities that way. Success. We kind of took it one game at a time and focused on each opponent as the games came along and focused on winning that game and I kind of kept the bigger picture in mind of winning Patriot Leagues but just took it one game at a time, focused on that game so we could keep going forward. I was originally looking to do a quick kickoff and hit, like look for someone that was running across the restraining line, but the Bucknell defender covered that space pretty quickly. So, And then I looked up and I saw that the goalie was all the way to the left side of the goal and left the whole right side open, so I just went and tried to curl it to the right side. It worked out. Well, at the end of the game, you kind of saw the scoreboard, and we had more shots and we had a lot of corner kicks also, so we had a lot of opportunities to score, and ultimately we didn't put any away, and that's kind of what hurt us in that game, and we didn't finish any goals, so we didn't end up coming out with a win, and we actually have been struggling with that before. We've only been scoring one or two goals per game, but we still came out with the wins, and yesterday it actually hurt us.